My name is Debbie Maui. I'm with Jamison Sotheby's International Realty in Chicago, Illinois. So the whole point of networking is really to get to know other agents to better serve your clients. Maybe you have clients going to another state and they're curious like what's available to them, what the price points are, what they can really get for their dollar there. You have that knowledge because you've already spoken to agents, you know what the market's like, you know what the activity is, you know if it's a buyer's market or a seller's market. So say we have a lot of people coming from New York or my clients I find are going to the Carolinas or to Florida. So I really try to develop relationships with agents in those areas. You wanna make an impression. It doesn't have to be anything elaborate, but it's just something that says, hey, wow, uh, you know, Debbie's from Chicago. Oh, I have a client going there. That's who she has to talk to. Remember, everyone else is in the same position you are. So everyone walks into the room and probably doesn't know anybody or maybe knows one person. It's not handing your business card off to somebody and expecting them to give you a call. It's getting to know them. It's asking about their markets, their business, and following up with them. You have to follow up. You have to continue that relationship. One of the best ways to stay in touch with your network and keep it organized is to use a CRM program. What I include in my CRM program is their name, their address, their market areas. I do stay in touch with these agents. I do try to get together with them. My personal philosophy of networking is just be yourself, get out of your comfort zone, go meet people. Every time I get on a plane by myself, I'm getting out of my comfort zone. Every time I leave that hotel room to go to a meeting, I'm getting out of my comfort zone. Keep in mind, the main purpose is to take care of your clients and in the end, everything will come back to you.